Now to the mass debate impacting our school. Some districts now requiring them, even though the governor says you can't. Starting Thursday, everybody has to wear a mask on campus at any Phoenix Elementary District school. Tonight, the Osborne District will talk about face coverings. And tomorrow, Tucson Unified will vote on whether to require face coverings on its campuses. Tonight, a teacher within the Phoenix Union School District filing a lawsuit against the district over its new mask mandate. The district returned to campus on Monday and was the first to openly defy a state law banning mask mandates at public schools. Political reporter Mark Phillips explains lawmakers are not taking notice. Defying the law in the name of health, more than 28,000 Phoenix Union High School students returned to class Monday, nearly all of them required to wear a mask. We're just going to continue to focus on the health and the safety and the well-being of everybody. But not everyone wants to be told what to do. Teacher Douglas Hester filed a lawsuit in Superior Court, hoping to overturn the mask mandate. They have to choose between uh, a law that has some questionable um, effectiveness around it and what they think is best for student and staff safety. The Arizona School Board Association says more districts are considering implementing their own mask mandates. Tucson Unified will decide Wednesday. School district administrators are acting like activists. They are not upholding the law. Scottsdale State Representative Joseph Chaplick wrote the bill which prevents city, county and state governments from imposing mask mandates. Chaplick warns the district should the back off. Happens. I think there's going to be a consequence if you're violating the law. There should be. We're, we're a society of law. In Arizona, some lawmakers are already talking about taking money away from districts who defy the mask mandate law. The attorney general who enforces the law has not commented on the mask mandate. For now, it will be left to a judge to decide whether school districts need to obey the will of the legislature. Mark Phillips, ABC 15, Arizona.